Here we go. Big Guns Raggy. He's Bring ready. it on. <laughs> ding, ding. <laughs> when it comes to celebrity <laughs> clients, our next guest is one personal trainer who actually has something to brag about. He makes the most powerful couple in the world a little bit more powerful. Yes, indeed. Cornell McClellan is the man behind the fit physiques of President and First Lady Obama. And he's here to show us a boxing workout that has worked wonders for the first couple. Good to have you with us this morning. Thank you. And it was Mrs. Obama who found you first, correct? That's correct. I started working with Mrs. Obama about 13 years ago. And then the president said, you know what? I better maybe get my own moves, huh? Yeah, so Just in started, case. Yeah, he started about nine or ten years ago. <laughs> how long, I mean, how much do you work with them on a weekly basis or a monthly basis? How much uh, do you see them? Maybe two or three times a week, something yeah. like that. I mean, it, it's mixed up. Their schedules are so busy, so Just they do what they can. I mean, there are people who are in fitness and they believe in fitness, so whether I'm there or not, they're working out, they're but, making sure. But you do still work with them regularly and, oh, I still and some work of the other staff are at yeah, the White House. Yeah, so what are some of the moves, if you're just starting out, why, why is boxing such a great workout for people? Well, boxing is a great workout because it's a great transfer uh, or crossover from one exercise to another. If you're going to be playing tennis, if you're going to be doing golf or baseball, because of the moves, because it teaches you to transfer your power and to change directions, that's just very important. And you use it in every sport that you do. Right. So we use it. It's a great cardio and aerobic kind of workout. Great for burning a lot of calories. Okay. Great for working the waistline. I love, I'm all about that waistline in, a, in like a month <laughs> or so. Yeah. Right? And, and, and since you are so wonderfully expecting, <laughs> you can only do slow motion and taps, no punching, oh, no jerking. It's let hard it, though it, because it, you really want to. Here's the great thing about boxing is you really just want to. You, you really, you, you really do. Especially well, we, if you got a stressful but, job like president. <laughs> yeah, but we can't allow you to do okay. that today. Yes, sir. So Chris is going to have okay. to. I've never boxed team. before, so go easy on me. Okay. I don't believe him. Yeah, right. I, I saw that wink of that eye. Right. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So what we want to do, Chris, is we yep. want to just kind of uh, have a left lead. You're going to bring your left foot forward. My left seat. Okay. And you kind of uh, just want to relax and kind of bend the knees. Mm -hmm. You bring your right hand by the jaw and the left hand out. And what I want you to do, we're going to do a jab. The first one is a jab. Mm -hmm. But again, what's important is knowing how to move. So we want you to pivot when you throw the jab. Okay. So we're going to take this hand and we're going to jab right in there. Pivoting. Beautiful. Beautiful. Oh, you've done this pivoting before. pivoting that front left foot. <laughs> right off the ball of the foot. The Beautiful. I like Show that. Off. So he's pivoting right there. Then the next one is I want him to try to then throw a cross. With that cross, again, talking about transferring the power, he's going to come from this side, then here. So he's pivoting right across the body. So now he's going to use there. See the beautiful pivot there? Transferring the power. So let's throw it a little quicker. Throw it. Beautiful. That's what right. I'm talking about. Right. Keep that glove up. Try it. I'm going to keep it up. Throw it. Excellent. <laughs> now let's put them together. You're going to go. Jab cross, beautiful, Ooh, good. Jab go. cross, good. Come on, try it again. That's what I'm talking about now. He takes so, a really good. tense it's concentration excellent. in his life. I like that. I but like I point that, that out for a good reason. Just good. like with any Kinda sport, you know, in myself. tennis they say follow the ball. In golf, you want to watch the ball. So that too, when you're when you're hitting, you always want to know where you your target focused, is, right? You want to be relaxed and you want to be able to move. And Chris okay. is doing all it excellently. So, so now we're going to add a thunder and lightning. Now we're going to add a third punch. So we're going to go back. Let's try the jab first. So we go jab, and then you're going to come with the cross. And then I want you to come back here with a hook. And the hook is beautiful. So let's try the hook first. Try the hook. Good. With that pivot. Notice the pivot. Okay. Transferring that power. Moving from the direction. So let's try jab. Good. Cross. Good. Hook. Beautiful. Let's try it again. Jab. Cross. Ah, uh, oh, that's what I'm talking about. Let's do it. Speed I'm ready. Let's go. Do it. Oh, good. Beautiful. Good. One more time. One more. One more. Oh, this is a man here. Beautiful. That's what oh, I'm snap. talking about. But you notice how his body was just moving, he's shifting, pivoting from side right. to side. If he was playing tennis, if he was swinging from a golf move, baseball, all that. So you that's how there. we use all that. that concentration. I'm, I'm just trying to be careful. Very slow. That's my trainer slow. who's instructed yes, me this yes, morning. Yes, very slow. Okay, so Making what are sure. some of the other... This is really... It gets your heart rate going, not mine, of course, I'm going, going slow. And what everybody talks about all the time, your core and your waistline, because of the pivoting motion, you use so many abdominal muscles, that's right. why we're not allowing you to throw this because hard. Yes. Because we do use so much abdominals when we're doing it. But this. when you're doing this, what, what about timing? I mean, how much of this do you need to do? Because you're getting your heart rate up so quickly and doing so much cardio at once, is this something that if you only have a little bit of time, this is a great workout for you if you have 20 minutes, or do you really need to devote an hour when you're doing a workout like well, this? It depends on the person. It depends on the goals. Okay. But certainly, if you only have 20 minutes, you can do it. And initially, when you start doing it, you probably can only do it for that long. If that because long. Because it is so cardiovascularly exerted. I'm exhausted so, watching. Yeah. So, nice and stuff. Nice and yeah, slow. Very good. Excellent. That's what I'm talking about. This is just wonderful. Right. Good. This is good. <laughs> good stuff. job. Such a treat to have you with us. It was my pleasure being here. Say hello to the here. first family for us. I will do that. Tell them thank thanks you for sharing so much. your moves. All right. Thank you. <laughs> just ahead. Also, we also and I, the little disclaimer, we had a picture of Lonnie inside Cornell's gloves, right? That made it. You gave it the away? Punch, well, the punching a little easier, but we wanted yeah, it. Yeah, uh, for the Chris.